Hi. Yes. Is that your motorhome? What can I help you with? Am I on video? Yeah. Why are you videotaping me? I don't know what you're doing here. Well, I'm going to tell you no. what I'm doing here. Is that your motorhome? Very simple question. <clears throat> yeah. Is that your motorhome? Uh-huh. Okay. The motorhome doesn't have any license plates on it. Yeah. And the motorhome is illegally parked. Do you have any weapons on you, sir? No. Yeah, I'm okay. asking for my own safety. Right. If you're, yeah, if you're, I don't have anything on me. Okay, that's not asking. Okay. Um, can't park a truck or a trailer in a residential area, which is, which that is, and it's legally parked. And it also doesn't have any registration on it. Uh -huh. So do you have the registration for that vehicle? Um, have you ever heard of civil disobedience? I know that's legal, and I'm not really committing a crime. Um, have you heard of that? The option is... I, I'm just you. asking my question, yes or no. Okay. Sir, what have you heard of that? What is your name, sir? I only need to identify yeah, myself to you. I'm quizzed by you, okay? My I don't need to... You're trying to quiz me. My question to you is... See, so you're asking me questions, but I can't ask you questions. I'm police from doing I don't have a right to ask you questions? Say, Are you telling me I don't have a right to ask you questions? That's what you're saying. I don't have a right to ask I'm you questions. You, you work for me, and I don't have a right to ask you questions, I'm is what you're sure. telling me. Seriously. So only you get to ask questions? You can ask questions and I can't. Well, officer, what's your badge number and, and name, please? What is your name, sir? What is your badge number and name? You work for me. You work for me. Okay, I don't have to tell you anything. Really? Yeah, you don't know how it works, do you? Let no, me see your. I don't. Let me see your card or something with uh, your name. I'm going to give you my name. In fact, I'm going to okay. put it on the parking ticket after I tow your truck away. And what makes you think you have the right there to you go, sir. tow my, my truck away? Have a nice day, sir. And what makes you think you have the right to tow my truck away, sir? Sir? And what makes you go think you have the right the to... Street. You're standing on the roadway. Go back on sir, the Sir, I'm an truck. adult. I know how to uh, operate a street. Thank you. All right, well. I'm going to have to be right back with this. Huh? I'll let you know I'm audio recording. Hey, you want to you want to park right here? You want to park right here so you can know, keep traffic? Okay, well, let you know I'm audio recording, so. Are you recording also? No. Excellent. Can I just keep your hands away from your firearms at all times? That'd okay. be great. Sounds good. So what are you already recording? Uh, I'm recording this encounter. Sorry? I'm recording this encounter. Okay. Yeah, you're being recorded too, by the way. That's fine. It's just legal and a constitutional right. Absolutely. What are you always up to today? Uh, just exercise our Second Amendment and go in for a stroll. Appreciate that. We did get a call from a concerned citizen. It looked like you are carrying an automatic firearm. It does look like an automatic firearm. It does. Experience. But so, with that being said, Automatic firearms, you're required to carry a, a, a name. Yeah, but it's a semi auto. I don't know that until I Well, you don't that. have reason to suspicion I that do, it. Actually, uh, my no. SWAT team gun looks exactly like that. It's fully really auto. Okay? Um, it's an MP5. So here's the lawful order you're going to be given. Okay. Okay. I want hands away from the firearm at all times. I okay. want you to remove hands from pocket and step back into the shade. That'd be great. All and I'm your do, name is M. Nork. Mike Nork. All I'm going to do is simply remove the firearm from you so you don't have you to know. touch it. Okay, but let you I'm know I don't consent to any search and seizures, and that would be in violation of our constitutional right and Article 1, Section 9 of Oregon's Constitution. Stop with the, stop with the rules. Okay? Well, you're an oath keeper. This is what we're going to do, is I'm going to ask you to put your hands out like this, straight to your sides. I'm not I'm doing it. I'm going to remove the firearm from you. Okay? Let me ask you, am I being detained? Yeah. Okay, well, I'm... Spread your arm out, please, like this. Both of them straight out. Excellent. Go ahead and turn away from me for a second. Excellent. But you know, I don't consent to any search and seizures. I understand that. I'm not seizing anything. I'm going to Well, this. it's still a violation of Terry versus Ohio. So. Okay. Due to my training experience, this doesn't look to be a fully uh, automatic firearm. Mm -hmm. It's a 22. It was not chambered, but magazine loaded in. It looks to be. Semi auto. Do a function check the firearm. And it operates it as such. I no longer have any reasonable suspicion to detain you. I appreciate that you are executing your Second Amendment rights. Mm -hmm. okay, I'll let you know that 
if it was a fully automatic firearm, you'd need your ID and the Class 3 stamp. True. Okay? Because when we roll up, it looks like a fully automatic MB5. That's why you were stopped today. Do you have any questions, comments, or concerns? Well, I would have still have to... Uh, but still, how do you know if it's a fully automatic firearm? Just based on the look. Experience. How all objects can look like a fully automatic weapon. I mean, a... a uh, uh, well, you know what? You know what you guys need to do. You need to come to one of our citizens' academy. We're actually show you guys and allow you to shoot fully automatic firearms. Actually, train you how to do it, okay. or join our reserve program. We'll, in which case, we'll actually issue you one. Also, so I would love to have you guys. You guys can pick up forms at the police department on how to do that. Okay. Any other questions, comments, concerns? Do you have any? Um, I'm just curious. Uh, like you said, it was your training, right? But every weapon, like everything other than. Issues. They're both fully automatic or so I You guys are talking about reasonable suspicion, right? Yeah. Wouldn't it be reasonable for me to assume that that could be a fully automatic firearm since it looks exactly like the all of since the 1980s that were been made? And those actually have been made until the late 90s. For every fully automatic firearm, you can't be purchased from the class 3 stamp. Unless you have a class 3 stamp, right. you have to buy a 386. A 386 gun is a minimum of like 10 grand to get fully automatic. It doesn't look seem reasonable for either a college kid or another kid to have. I, I don't have the golden ball that shows me what you guys are value wise. Uh, super good. Early 20s is worth multi millions. So, you know, I, I, I don't work on that. I work on reasonable suspicion. You already admitted that it's a reasonable suspicion to think that looks like an AP5 and it's fully automatic. And as you guys know, uh, obviously, I don't know if I told you or not, you're not detained anymore. I you should know okay. that reasonably by now, anyways. But, uh, yeah, I haven't asked for ID. You guys are free to go. I did my job. I'm glad you guys are exercising your Second Amendment rights. With you guys in the area, we're not going to have any crime, and I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. Nobody's going to commit crimes if you guys stand around. Mm -hmm. All right. Any well, other questions, well, comments, well, concerns? Well, well, hey, good job, guys. Have All a good right. one. Thank you. All right, see you later. You too. Have a good day. Any comments? No. Did you put in my magazine in my butt? So we're here outside the Dearborn Police Station. We're going to go in and uh, file a complaint because we were illegally pulled over about an hour ago. Isn't that right, Brandon? That's 100% accurate. We felt uh, a little afraid for our lives when we were pulled over, so we figured we'd better protect ourselves. Box the car in. 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 Box the car
Put your hands above your head. Put your hands above your head. Put your hands above your head. Okay. Put your hands above your head. Okay. 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 Got a handgun. Open this up. Hey, open this up. Wolski, Nate. Come on, dude. I'm here. 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 I'm